It's the Modern Hip Hop Channel in 95.3, Mr. Peter Parker, 3 to 7 weekdays. You know, a couple times a week, around 6, 6.30. I like to go local. Um, <laughs> you, you're, you're going national, though. You're good. <laughs> I'm in here with my boy, Dem Atlas. How you feeling? What's good? I feel good. I feel good. I'm, I'm, I'm grieving right now, but I feel yeah. all right. I feel very, all right. very heavy day. We're going to touch on that in a minute. Yeah. You got some new music, a yeah. new project brewing yeah. up. We got a show next week. Yeah. Very cool. <laughs> um, next Wednesday night, Joey Badass, Dem Atlas, Nikki Heaton, Finding No Vion, DJ Sophia Aris, Oof. and more. I, you know I got some tricks up my sleeve, man. <laughs> no doubt, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you went on tour with Joey Badass. Yes, I did. I did a short stint with Joey Badass uh, in 2014. Very cool. Yeah, it was cool. It was cool. I Man. can see that you guys are very complimentary acts. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. you definitely different. I really, I really dig his, his energy, man. He's, yeah, man. He, he got me hip to some crystals. I think he carries around. Uh, yeah, man. Uh, I don't even know the very name. Very big. He with carries the chakras, around crystals. The chakras and and the different uh, uh, energies and power points on your body. And, yeah. And he's very enlightened soul. Yes. For a young guy. Yes. The first time I met him, I pulled up on him in Maryland. At, I think it was a Smokers Club tour, mm -hmm. and I and I pulled up on him and I saw him and I was so excited to meet him. Yep. I grabbed him and I was like, <laughs> I was like, Yo, you're the future of hip hop. No doubt. And he kind of was like, Thanks, crazy white guy. See you later. <laughs> like he kind of dipped on me. You know what I mean? Like, but but I, I was so excited Damn, because. Man. That's how I felt even four years ago. Yeah. And to see what he's becoming today, I'm excited to have you out there next week. Can we talk about um this garbage trash? You got some new music? No doubt. Yeah. I got this new mixtape coming out July 15th. It's called MF Dim. I released my first single from that mixtape called Garbage Trash. Right. Um, And basically, it's just me, me venting and being like, you know, the first line of the song is, you know, I really need to grow up. I really need to get older, wiser, you know, because I just, it's, I feel I've been in a state of, of constant growth and change, but I still don't feel like I'm quite independent enough, as yeah. independent and as strong as I want to be. Yeah. So that song is basically like, will somebody help me out, you know? Right, right. Because, okay. yeah, it's a jazzy joint. Let's get into it right now. We're going to play this garbage trash. We come back, we're talking about new projects, the Go Show next week, and I really want to hear... What you have to say about what happened last night, yeah. what happened in Louisiana. Yeah. I'd love some feedback from you. Let's get into this one right now. Dem Atlas, Garbage Trash. We're talking more with Rhyme Sayer Zone. Dem Atlas next. Woo! Very hot record. It is a jazzy joint. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. like that. I like your wave, man, on stage, too. You kind of float, bro. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I fly, man. Yeah, Nothing can hold me back. That is... I think being on stage is, is when I'm truly myself and when I'm truly comfortable with myself, you know. Mm -hmm. Off stage, it feels like I'm, I have this mask on, but that's when I can take it off and just be wild when I'm on stage. Yeah, just, man. Mm. You had these amazing flowered jean pants on <laughs> and these boots. I'd never seen someone jump so high with these tight pants on. You were like, <laughs> son, you were up. And I was like, okay, <laughs> you got it. This is it. You're an amazing performer, hey, amazing performer, Thanks. great energy. Come check out Dem Atlas next Wednesday night at the Fine Line. Can't Joey wait. Badass, Finding Novion, Nikki Heaton, our brother Dem, and more. Mm -hmm. What's this new project you're working on outside of the um, MF Doom Thing that you got going on that mixtape yeah you, you have some new collaborative efforts coming out new new music yeah yeah i got this joint um i got a little surprise with my man jay plaza dope. um got a joint with metasota very dope. Um, that's gonna be ready soon um so i've just really been trying to branch out and collaborate more with yeah. artists i respect in the city yeah you know definitely want to get up with sophia Aris, lizzo allen crazy. someday crazy i, don't, I just i just want to I just want to collaborate more, but also working on um, my my L LP, my yeah. album effort. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah no, we, we need that. We need that official I Rhyme know. Sayers release. I know, man. You Damn. almost there? You almost there? Man, it's a journey, and I, I respect the journey, and I'm I'm not almost there, but I, I'm on my way. I found the it's path. It's a beautiful thing. And I spent, like, probably two years trying to find that path and just making a lot of music here and there, but I think I'm very confident that I found my path, and I'll get there. No, I, I feel you. Know. I feel I feel the same way about what I'm doing over here. I feel like I, I know what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. I, I'm in the right position, but we're not quite there yet. Yeah. And I'm looking forward to getting there. Yeah. Um, part of that getting there is rising to the occasion 
when things get serious as well. No doubt. Um, we had a horrific ordeal that happened last night. Mm -hmm. um, do you want to talk about how you feel about what's going on in America right now? <sighs> yeah, I, I, uh, I absolutely do. Um, I, when I heard about it, I was, I was uh, with my friend and uh, my man Ashanti called me up and he was just like, right. "They gun another one of us down, man." They gun another one of us down. They don't. They don't care about us. They don't care about us. They. And I, I saw the footage and I saw the video from, from the cat in Louisiana, and I'm, I just, I, I'm in a loss for words, man. I'm in a loss for words. I, I really try to speak from a place of intense clarity, mm -hmm. but my first initial reaction when I heard of. Still being shot down in front of his kid was just extreme rage, extreme rage. Right. I said, "Fuck the police," and I said, "Fuck you, America." You know, was my first reaction. Right. And because I just don't. Every day I feel like we're inundated with this menial garbage on Twitter, on Facebook, everywhere. Just menial stupidity. But when something real like this happens, we really need to mobilize, organize, and wake up. Yeah, man, I uh, I felt uh, immense pain when I when I heard about this. I, we were already grieving. We already felt a certain way. Um, if anybody out there is listening right now and and they're they're angry and they're hurt, what could you say to them? I uh, my 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 condolences, and uh, you're not alone, and. My prayers are with you. My blessings are with you, and I, I am thinking. I'm thinking about you. I'm sending good energy, just comfort. I'm gonna pray. Yeah, man. I mean, I'm gonna march. Yeah, I'm gonna be there. I'm yeah. going to be there. Yeah, I'm man. going to share my music and my message, and uh, that's that's all I can do. Does this all change the do. way that you make music? Yeah, it alters. You as a person, I can imagine, yes. and 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 now when the the pen comes to pad and the thoughts come together, these thoughts are in involved. Yes, I'm yes. looking forward to hearing that music. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Me too. Your energy when I met you outside the doors today, and I said, "How are you?" And he's, "I'm sad today," and and I felt the same way. And, and I wanted to talk about the positive stuff in the show. You're gonna be out there next Wednesday. We now we have a platform. Yeah. You're here with this microphone. Yes. You have a stage next Wednesday night yeah, to man. say how you feel and 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 let's make some sort of positive out of this. Whatever we can do as a group mm. to show that it's really not a white black thing, really. It's a poor people versus the cops or people versus police officers in, in so many ways. Yeah, man. I mean, at the same time, it Historically, it is a white black thing. I, I, I know. When I, I, saw, I do agree. When I saw the uh, the footage of, of the cat that was gunned down in Louisiana, his name is uh, Alton uh, Alton Sterling. Alton Sterling. Alton Sterling. Alton Sterling. I saw a portrait of two white men with a gun to his back. You're right. On top of this black brother, you know, and to me that encapsulates. That is that is the portrait of centuries of abuse, neglect, and intense hatred for black people in this country. Mm -hmm. Centuries. And that, that small that small Twitter news feed photo, right. you know. Right. And that encapsulated that to me. And so yeah. it is there is a great disparity of rich and poor, but it also is an historic thing of this relationship this tumultuous relationship of white and black people, mm -hmm. you know, and the misunderstandings. And there can be, there are white allies that get it. They can't fully ever get it, but they they stand with us, you I know. Agree. They stand with us hand to hand in these marches and in these protests. But there are also, there's a great number of people that aren't awake. They don't, they don't see it as... Their brother or their mother or their lover or their their You're friend, right. Right. they see it as just, well, maybe if they had done this, maybe maybe the the cop is always right. They're 
the servant, no, no, no. No, no, not. You're not is, paying attention. This is undeniable. There's no justification for what happened. Yeah. And, and hopefully, yeah. When, when, hopefully when, you're, when you're here mm. and, and you're here with me in the studio, you see an ally. Because that's what I am. And I want, I want to see change in America. Amen. Amen. Appreciate you, brother. Damn, Atlas. It's my brother, man. You're going to check him out there next Wednesday night. Real talk from hey, a real you dude. better. Man. Come on, come <laughs> see him, man. This kid floats on stage, man. We're doing something positive over here. Yes, indeed. Respect, too. Much love. Much love. Much love.